Welcome back, brothers and sisters. We are on the road to El Nido and Quran. El Nido and Quran are the fourth most popular tourist destinations on the planet. Anyone brave enough to go in? <laughs> so if you're dreaming about coming to the Philippines, maybe visiting El Nido or Quran, you're going to love this video. Right now, we're about to drive through Tai Tai. Shortly thereafter, we're going to hit the legendary El Nido. So join us on this epic adventure as we tour hotels, we do island tours, we give you prices, show you options, and give you a heads up of what this is all about. So it's time to kick the tires and light the fires. Let's explore this place. All right, guys, we're in Tai Tai, or Tay Tay, depending on how you pronounce it. There it is right there. Waterfall and all kinds of cool stuff. And there's some civilization here. We got some gas stationage and some storage. Actually, there's yum yums. There's all kinds of stuff. All right, brothers and sisters, day number two. First stop, we're in Tay Tay, or Tata. I don't even know how to pronounce it. But this is the town of Tata. And the roundabout that I just went about, went around, uh, is right there. And I am on my carnivore, carnivore diet, so I'm gonna get myself some liempo, which is pork, roasted pork, if they have it. If not, I need to get a big messy chicken and chop chop. Oh no, I see no liempo. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. It's just easier to eat. It sounds good. Hello. Hey buddy. Hey. You wanna be on YouTube? It's okay? All right. How much for your lamp for? 190, one piece, sir. All right. One piece, chop, chop, yeah? Slice? Yeah, please. So this, uh, how do you say your town? Uh, Tay Tay or? Tay. Okay. Your town, Tay Tay or Ta Ta? Tay Tay. You're in the roundabout, it's a name. Tay uh, Tay. Tay Tay. All right, so I'm not, it's not Ta Ta, it's Tay Tay, I learned. So this is um, this is Liempo, guys. This is just pork. It's beautiful. It's uh, $2.90, so it's a little more expensive than Porta Princesa. But $2.90 for the I'm gonna whoop that down. Sounds good. Yeah, I'm a carnival guy, and I need to eat later. And I'm not sure what I'm gonna find. Can I steal a piece? That looks so good. Hot, good. Oh man, the skin is so crispy. You put salt on there, yeah? It's good. Wow, it's good. I tell you what. One more piece. One more? Yeah, one more. You should make everybody taste. Take one bite and make bite by two. <laughs> yes. Yeah, same. Right. I'm gonna eat in the car. Do you have any napkins, like paper towel? Because I'm gonna eat in the car. Paper? No. No? Okay. But I better eat clean. Jack. Yeah, I'm Jack. Thank you, sir. Yeah, no problem. Oh, I gotta pay you. You want money? Well, uh, <laughs> 380. What's your name, brother? Jerrosa. Uh, Jerrosa. I'm Jack. Nice to meet you. And I'm gonna rip this Lampo apart. It's so good. All right, my friend. Thank you, sir. Very good. Oh, uh, how much for the water? Too big. No, sir. Oh, she for you? That's not fair. <laughs> That's okay. Oh, yeah. You have a good day. Yeah. So, I scored my food, but I haven't drink. I need a drink. So I'm gonna go find some drink. Got my liempo, but I have no no water, so I'll be right back. You can have some. It's really crispy and fresh. All right, let's go to the legendary kings. One of my favorites. Hello. Hello. Good afternoon to you. 
Oh, wow. Oh. Do you have any uh, Coke Zero, maybe? <laughs> Sorry, sir. Oh, no problem. Do you have maybe Coke Zero? No Coke Zero. What's this down here? Um, Mountain Dew? Which Mountain Dew? Is it Diet? No. No Zero? Okay. Do you have water? Uh, I'll be. All right. All right, nothing. Thank you. Bye, ladies. Bye. <laughs> I need something to drink, man. Pharmacy? Yeah, we may have a pharmacy. So I'm gonna hunt for something to drink. Something without sugar. I cannot have sugar. I like the way I feel. I feel good, no sugar. We need to solve that problem. Hello. Any chance? No, huh? No Coke Zero. No. Any diet soda? No? Cold water? Do you have water? Okay, if it was cold, that'd be great. I scored water, guys. I, diet soda is so hard to find. Salam and Poe. You want to say hello to YouTube? Hi. Yeah, what's your name? Ibo. Ibo. Nice to meet you. I'm Jack. Nice to meet you. Yeah, you Tay Tay. What is it? Tata -ta or Tay Tay? Okay. What's the name here? Tay Tay. Tai Tai. Tai Tai. Oh, okay. Tai Tai will be on YouTube in about three weeks. Salam and so guys, I found my water. I'm happy, I found my water. Hey big guy, I like your ball. Maliempo. Mmm, barbecue pork. Charge those batteries so we can continue to kick the tires and light the fires. Can't have those fires go out, can we? Mm. Mm. We'll see you guys on the road. So, this is just a brief look at Tai Tai, one of the brown guys you will be passing through on the way to El Nino. Tai Tai is a very friendly little community. I recommend stopping by, support the local economy, buy some food, and take a look around. So guys, we're on a mango hunt. Random mango tree in Northern Plowin. We must feast. Not exactly carnivore, but it'll do. Tree, right there. Ah. Over here, dude, look. Hey, Lewis, what are you doing right here? But it's right here. It's right here. <laughs> He's going for the hard one. He got it though. Man caught himself a mango. It's a whopper of a mango. Dude, bring that stick. Let's get these. Yeah, we're mango harvesting, man. Big Red is doing us good. Getting us some fresh mangoes from the trees, boys and girls. No, there's a big fat one there, yeah? Ah, oh, technique. Oh, damn, he almost got it. <laughs> it's my practice. Smack it with a stick. You twist your ankle, man. You're not going to have fun this week. <laughs> Back to the stick it. method. Harder, baby! Bruh. Yeah. Just smack it. Huh? Oh, here he comes. Oh, no. I thought he was going to whale it. He did it! <laughs> I want to try one. I'm going to pick my first mango of my life. Here, hold the camera. My first mango pick. Right. There's big there. Alright, so. There's big. Here, I'm gonna take this one. What? Up, up, up. There's big. Film me, damn it. Ready? My first mango pick. Woo! Ah, so easy, man. Another one here. It looks good. Are we allowed to do this? Well, no, the mango. Oh, that's. 
You break it. It's all broken. Man. That one's for you. That's it. Stay. This is too much already. Okay. Well, have fun, man. Pick the mangoes, guys. No. There are hundreds of mangoes. That's enough. Man. Bruh. By the way, that was also my first bamboo. Yeah. That was my first bamboo tool in my life. Oh, they smell good, dude. Yeah. I have my knife. It's ripe. It's almost overripe. There's a lot of big there. Yeah. Hey, let me see. That smells delicious, guys. It's yellow it smells inside. Smells fresh. Yeah. Yep. Let me show. See? Yeah. It's already Shit, I'm going to have to take a taste. <laughs> here, here, come here. Bring. Oh. Never you? mind. Okay. Mango hunt! Yeah! Northern Palawan, we scored mangoes! <laughs> <laughs> Brother! Now we gotta score some cashews. Let's just eat this first. Okay. Let me get my tissues, my fingers are all sticky. There's tissue there. I need wet ones. Let's just put it here. Where's your knife? I'm taking with the fishing. I don't really know. Uh oh, that sucks. Yeah, it'd be too hard to find. What's going on with this? <laughs> that sucks. So, I'm gonna let you tear your teeth so you don't get messy, you just tear teeth. So guys, uh. Guys, Thanks. Westerner, Westerner tastes his first self-picked mango. I picked this myself with some real bamboo. <laughs> it smells amazing. <laughs> oh, shit. It's very bitter, dude. <laughs> It's not amazing. <laughs> it smells good, guys. <laughs> it's not bad. <laughs> it burns a little. But really. A little crunchy. Not bad. But I'm on my carnivore diet. I'm just tasting a little juice. Speedy on the pulp. I don't want the carbs. That one is fun. Mm. Mm. I'm gonna have to throw this out. Mm. Mm. Honestly, guys, if it wasn't on my diet, I would eat that whole thing. Look at all those mangoes. You see yeah. the ripe one? Oh, the orange ones. So yeah, right up toward the top there, there's some more yellow orange ones. Those are those are properly ripe. We're eating the green ones. And even the green ones are edible, man. They're not bad. So, the enthusiasm is real. <laughs> my reaction was real, too. I tasted it and I was like, oh my gosh. Bitter. What do you think? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs>because we stopped for our mangoes. The scenery here is outstanding. I actually think the views are better than Southern Plowing. But keep in mind, when I went to South, it was in the dry season and it was the end of the dry season, a long dry season. Things were a lot browner. And this is almost a month later, probably a good month later. And we're in the rainy season now. Things are beautiful and green and lush. I love it. And you got these odd shaped mountains that are peaks and some go up like that. Reminds me of the Grand Canyon. Some of those plateau things, but with trees on them. So, let's get back in the car, man. I'm almost out of batteries. Let's rock and roll. By the way, this one is good to eat with um, baguong. 
What's that? My goal is uh, swim. <laughs> swim. You know, the swim in the bottle. Ah. Good. I see. We like it. Yeah. So the bitter? The bitter? This the flavor? The bitter in the saltiness of the bubble. You know, it's much. Yeah, okay, that makes sense. So, yeah, so if you ever have shrimp in a bottle, I think you said bottle. Shrimp in a bottle? No, just shrimp. Alamang, alamang or bagoo. Yeah, you know what he said. But it sounds good. I would love to try it. Uh, okay, there's all my crappage. Goodbye, crappage and courage. I must turn around and do a dangerous, illegal U turn. I don't know if it's illegal, but dangerous. I will see you guys on the road. Peace. Stay tuned, guys and girls. This is coming up next. We are hitting the legendary El Nido town and then Kron. So stay tuned, buckle up, and let's rock.